Yo guys, what is good? What is popping? And welcome back to another video. And welcome to 2023. We thank the Almighty God for letting us to see this new year 2023. And the new year has started again. Official Cracker is back again with another update. Please. If you have not subscribed yet to the channel, this is 2023. Please subscribe to the channel and don't be angry that every day I say subscribe to the channel. There are a lot of people, if you did not say they should subscribe, they will not subscribe. And if you have subscribed to the channel, thank you very much. Thank you for always staying tuned and thank you in advance for being with me in 2023. And if you have not followed my Facebook page yet, please go and follow the Facebook page. Guys, let us make wonders to this Facebook page. Now, in today's news, we are going to be talking about the warmly welcome that Bologna and Ravenna and its surrounding Emilia Romagna, the warmly welcome that they have given to 113 immigrants. Guys, this welcome is incredible. Bologna and Emilia Romagna Ravenna to its nearby cities has done an amazing job to migrants. I reported a video in last year, 2022, that Ocean Viking was carrying 113 migrants and they were to go all the way 1,700 kilometers, which is four days from Liguria to Ravenna to disembarked migrants. The president of Emilia Romagna, Stefano Bonaccini, he came out and he said that these migrants, they are going to welcome them. And finally, they warmly welcomed these immigrants. The Ocean Viking, they were saying that Emilia Romagna has given them a welcome rescue. Everything was in order. Everything was in order. Now, they said, Ocean Viking docks in Ravenna unloading the hopes and dreams of dozens of migrants. On December 31st, that was yesterday, in the, in the presence of dozens of police, coast guide, officials, and medics, the Ocean Viking rescue ship disembarked the last of 113 migrants at the port of Ravenna in northern Italy. Free, free land and sea report for info migrants. Now, they said the mission is accomplished, says Luisa Albera, rescue coordinator on board the Ocean Viking. 113 people disembarked safely in a port that was quite warm and friendly. The Italian authorities have prepared for disembarkation for a few days, so I know that all of them have been taken care of properly. Now, ahead of preparation, this, this is what the Emilia Romagna region decides. On the morning of 28th December, an inspection was carried out on board the ship by the prefecture, after which it was decided that out of 100, 113 migrants, 79 will remain in Emilia Romagna, who will be distributed across the region according to a plan put together by the prefecture of Bologna. Now, they said this means in practice that 18 will be housed in Bologna, 6 in Ferrara, 7 in Forlì Cazena, 12 in Modena, 8 in Parma, 5 in Piacenza, 7 in Ravenna, 10 in Reggio Emilia, and 6 in Rimini. So they have already shared the migrants before they even arrived to disembark them. So this was a warmly welcome to these migrants. And first of all, let's watch how these migrants were getting down from the rescue ship. When we are back, we will give you the rest of the update. So stay.
have seen the video and I'm not forgetting the video of the president of Emilia Romagna that is Stefano Bonaccini what he said before these migrants even arrived in Ravenna let's watch that video too when we are back we'll give you the rest of the update so stay tuned c'è una nave che il 31 tra pochi giorni porterà eh, oltre 100 donne uomini e bambini a sbarcare al porto di Ravenna indipendentemente dal colore politico del governo noi siamo quelli, lo dico da presidente di regione ma anche di appartenente al Partito Democratico, che pensano che sia un dovere salvare ogni vita in mare e dare dignità alle persone che arrivano. Certo, una cosa il governo spero la spiegherà, com'è possibile che una nave che arriva in Liguria fa la circunnavigazione dello stivale italiano per arrivare a Ravenna quando incontro avrebbe trovato tantissimi altri porti d'Italia. Mi auguro non ci sia il retropensiero che portarli in una regione governata dal centro-sinistra non metta in difficoltà le regioni governate al centro-destra. I've seen the video and this is the update I have for you today. If you want update back to back in this video 23, all what you have to do is to share my video, like the video, go to Facebook and follow me and you are going to get it back to back. In fact, this 2023 is going to be a wonderful year. Is it document? Is it working? God is going to make everything possible for us. Until we meet again in the next video, please stay safe and stay blessed.